Welcome back fellow YouTubers to Logic Keys Tutorials. Today we will be attacking LMA's Gut Feeling. And I really chose this song because I really like the chordal arrangements. I'm all about the chordal arrangements. They really they sound really good. There are two different variations, one for the chorus, one for the the uh one for the verse, one for the chorus. I'm going to go through both variations. But before we start, please press that like button. And if these these uh, tutorials are helping you out in your endeavor to become a better musician, please subscribe to this channel. It really helps me out when you do. All right, so first, we're going to go with the intro, which is also the verse. And this is a walkthrough first. first chord can be played because he does that too in there I think he does that first before he does this okay and that's the that's going to be your intro slash verse then they go to and the chorus they look at the star feeling actually you go Something like that. So, but we're gonna go back to the beginning and I'll give you the intro. And so that's gonna be F sharp, B flat, C sharp, F. And up here you just, I just go from E flat uh, to F sharp, I mean F. Back to C sharp, I'm sorry, E flat. C sharp, C. So C sharp, back to C, B flat, C. That's the second chord, so. And that chord can be played here or here. As long as you come back to so that second chord as I play it here is gonna be your A flat B flat and C E flat F that's gonna be played with that or Back to your first chord and then you just play this chord up here to fatten it up the same keys your F sharp uh, B flat C sharp and F just to thicken it up and then so so uh, it's gonna be F E flat D. Uh, D is gonna. So you just C to D, then your half step to C sharp, back down to C, and then uh, B flat. 
And that chord down here in the left hand will be E flat, F sharp, G, B flat, and then C and D. And then uh, you have your E flat, A, C sharp, and E flat. And then you have your A up here, C sharp, E flat, F, and A flat. And you can go, if you're ending it, you can go uh, to your F sharp, back to the first chord, or the way they did it. Hit the B flat, back to the first chord. And that's the intro. Down here to the chorus, it's going to be the same chord, but you're just going to be. You're only going to play in your bass here, uh, F sharp, C sharp, F, and then your F sharp up here, B flat, C sharp, and F. So that chorus, and that's going to be your uh, B flat. Your F, A flat, and if you can't reach here, just shorten it here and play that with this, which will be C, E flat, A flat, and C. So you. Here you have your octave E flat with your B flat in between. Then you're gonna have the first chord, which is gonna the first chord that we showed you is gonna be F sharp, uh, B flat, C sharp, and F. And then no, it's so E flat C sharp C and then when you go down here that's the chord you're gonna play so you get to... so and that chord is C F and G B flat D and F. And that chord is F, C, E flat, F, and then you're going to have A, C sharp. E flat, F, and A flat. pretty much the song if you have any 
any uh questions comments leave them below man i love you guys don't forget to hit the the uh like button and i'll go i won't play those those last chords so fast maybe you you want to pick up on them i'm not gonna break them down but you you know and all I did there was just take take this note this uh, C <laughs> so I'm playing up here and put it down here and take that note and put it down here take that note put it down here That's all I did actually. Lot of passing chords like that too so or you can use that too so you, the way you play that Anyway, <laughs> sorry for that lengthy uh, little jazz quarter. If you have any questions about that too, just leave them in the comments below. I can walk you through some of that stuff. But I've gotten you through the core of the song. And once again, please subscribe. Thank you so much for watching.